Welcome to Basic Mechanical Engineering Playlist. Today I am going to discuss about types of alternative fuels, especially CNG and LPG. So first of all see the outlines of the session. Types of alternative fuels, CNG that means compressed natural gas, LPG that means liquefied petroleum gas, then difference between CNG and LPG and at last interesting facts. So let's start from the first types of the alternative fuels. So here you can see CNG that means compressed natural gas, LPG that means liquefied petroleum gas, hydrogen gas, biofuels. So these fuels are considered as the alternative of these fuels. So let's start from the first CNG. And here you can see the CNG tank that is used to store the compressed natural gas in the vehicle. And here you can see the whole arrangement of the compressed natural gas kit. Compressed natural gas that means CNG is natural gas under pressure which remains clear, odorless and non-corrosive. It is also a cheaper, greener, that means non-pollutant and a more efficient alternative to the traditional petrol and diesel fuels for the vehicles. NG, that means natural gas, is compressed to 1% of its volume at standard atmospheric pressure, then you will get CNG. So the volume of the natural gas is decrease 99 percent then you will get compressed natural gas. It is stored and distributed in hard containers at a pressure of 210 bar. So here you can see the hard container. Here also in this figure you can see high pressure storage vessels with the help of the compressor. In response of high fuel prices and environmental concerns, CNG is now being used in auto rickshaws, cars and buses, etc. CNG is lighter than air, so in case of accident, CNG dissipates into air and thus it is considered as a safe fuel. Now next, advantages of CNG. CNG is one of the most variable alternatives to traditional liquid fuels for vehicles. CNG is cheaper than gasoline that means petrol resulting in substantial saving in fuel cost. CNG reduces maintenance cost since it contains no additives and burns cleanly leaving no any byproducts of combustion to contaminate your spark plug and engine oil. CNG is more environment friendly and CNG engines are much quieter that means we can consider almost noiseless due to the higher octane rating of CNG over gasoline. CNG produces less exhaust emissions and as a result harmful emissions such as carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide and nitrous oxides are generally reduced. And here you can see natural gas distribution system. So if you compress the natural gas with the compressor then you will get the CNG and then with the CNG station you can fill up the CNG to the vehicle. Now the summary of the advantages of CNG. Now next one LPG. So here you can see LPG cylinder and this is the process to get the LPG. So liquefied petroleum gas is a flammable mixture of hydrocarbon gases used as a fuel in heating appliances and vehicles. It is also used as a refrigerant to reduce damage to the ozone layer. LPG includes propane and butane. 
So main content of the LPG is the propane and butane. If it is either cooled down or put under pressure, it changes into a liquid state. Since pure LPG is odorless, that means there is no any smell. A powerful odorant is added to identify leaks easily. Next, unlike the others, LPG never occurs on its own and you will only be able to find it naturally in combination with either natural gas or crude oil. So, LPG is actually a byproduct that only emerges when these fuels are processed. So, here you can see if you process crude oil, then you will get as a gas. Approximately 60% is produced during the extraction of the natural gas. Here you can see. And remaining 40% to be recovered through the crude oil in refinery. LPG will evaporate at normal temperature and pressure and is supplied in pressurized steel cylinders. Here you can see. Now next, they are typically filled between 80% and 85% of their capacity to allow for thermal expansion of the contained fluid. So here you can see it is filled 80 to 85% of the total capacity of the gas cylinder to allow for the thermal expansion. And you can check it like this. Here you can see with the red color because of it is the empty portion. And if it is filled over here, then you can see with the green color. So you can check it also. LPG is heavier than air and thus will flow along floors and tend to settle down in low spots such as basements. This can cause ignition or suffocation hazards if not dealt with and so that it is a little bit dangerous compared to the CNG. Now the interesting facts. NGL is a group of hydrocarbons means natural gas liquids here you can see ngl including ethane propane normal butane isobutane pentane plus and natural gasoline they are a byproduct of natural gas processing and refining so here in this figure you can see from ethane to pentane plus considered as a natural gas liquids. NGLs are removed from natural gas at a natural gas processing plants as a combined stream. So NGLs are actually removed from the natural gas at natural gas processing plants as a combined stream. That means it is a combination process. Note that the three traditional LPGs, that means propane, butane and isobutane, which fall under the larger umbrella of NGL. So LPG, that is also the part of natural gas liquids. Whereas LNG, that means liquefied natural gas, which is not considered as a NGL. Here also you can see in this figure, although LNG is actually considered as a natural gas, but it is not considered as a NGL. So this is a very important figure. You can understand from this figure the difference between LNG, LPG, natural gas and NGL. Now the very important point, difference between CNG and LPG. So the very important point, first definition. CNG is compressed natural gas. Whereas LPG is liquefied natural gas. Now the contents. Mainly methane in CNG. Mainly propane and butane in LPG. Next fuel state. Fuel is in gaseous state in CNG. Whereas in LPG fuel is in liquid state. 
effects. CNG produces a fewer amount of harmful gases, whereas LPG produces harmful gases to some extent. So LPG is a little bit dangerous to the environment compared to CNG. Storage Cylinder or spherical containers made of hard material in case of CNG. Cylinder or horizontal containers made of a little hard material for LPG. So keep in mind that in case of CNG it is a hard material, in case of LPG it is a little bit hard material. Next space it requires comparatively more space because it is gas. Required less space because it is liquid. Next, shifting. It is lighter than air and disperses quickly if leaks. In case of LPG, it is heavier than air and accumulates quickly if leaks. Put your valuable feedback in the comment box for motivating me to make more videos. Thanks my dear friends for watching this video.